The Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, had declared uh, Mr. Thaddeus Atta of the Labour Party, the winner of the Etiosa federal constituency seat in the House of Representatives um, back in February this, um, this year. Thaddeus, an unpopular politician, contested and won the February 25th, 2023 House of Representatives election for Etiosa federal constituency in the metropolitan Lagos state against the candidate of the PDP, Banki Wellington, Uluban Kole Wellington, also known as Banki W, um, the, an award-winning musical artist, and the candidate of the APC, Babaji De Obanikoro, the incumbent member of the Federal House of Representatives, run, uh, running for a return ticket to the House. Atta won with 24,075 votes, beating his counterpart, Mr. Uluban Kale Wellington of the PDP, who had 18,666 votes, and Mr. Babajide Obanikoro of the APC, who had 16,901 votes. Now that the tribunal has ordered that INEC to conduct a supplementary election in the 32 polling units of Etiosa within 90 days, um, the order to withdraw the return certificate issued to ATA and conduct elections in areas where the elections were, wasn't held on the 25th of February. Today we're asking, is the tribunal's dismissal of ATA, um, ATA's win, rather, a good thing for Etiosa? Now, please, let's hear what you have to say. Remember, you can join the conversation. Send us an SMS or WhatsApp to read one eight zero three four six six three. Um, I like us to really hear from people that are living within Etiosa, mm. you know, what you think. Uh, but let me quickly come to Mary, because this was supposed to be your what's in the news. <laughs> 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 Why did you pick it in the first place? Like, what came to your mind when you saw the the post? I think somebody, okay, it was Dami. Dami shared it last night. Yeah. Mm. She shared it to the group last night, yes. Oh, okay. Yeah, go ahead. I, I only saw it this morning. And um, I just felt like it was very unfair, because... The attack guy is, you know, not really known, and all of a sudden they just want to dismiss him. So, um, following up with the whole presidential election, it it now seems like they are trying to get back at Labour Party to tell them that oh, you thought that you won, you know, because I feel like this is not even going to be the only one. If there are other states where. Um, there was another Labour Party member that was removed mm -hmm. from something recently. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If, yeah. if, if I'm... Is it, was that Labour Party, but, or, but, but it's in the East, yeah? Go yeah. ahead. There was another one that was sacked in the yes, East. Yes, you know, so it's, and it's just... It's just Please, let me check that. Um, it's just very sad because even the little um, free and fair election we had, at least in the sub-communities, is seeming not free and fair anymore. And um, Banky W, who is now a pastor, you know, made a comment, which at first I didn't read any meaning into it when he said, um, still, possible. still still possible or something. And I went to the comment section and people, I saw a different point of view. At first, I didn't read any meaning into it. I, I saw it, I was like, oh, he still has hope to me. But then again, it came to mind to think, ah. Uh, if someone truly won, like, I were you praying all the while that you know injustice would happen so that you would, you know, come into the light, or because you know that obviously if they redo it again, you're hoping to win? But like, it was just, it was just very sad that he would think that way. I'm not saying it's a game, politics is a game, everybody wants to be a winner. But I think it's just very unfair, unfair towards Atta and unfair to Nigerians as a whole. Mm. You know, if it's clear that someone won with 20, some, 20 something thousand votes and the others have 18,000 votes, I don't see any reason why the tribunal will now just come. There are no solid grounds on which they're um, removing Atta. I don't know why they would do that, but I think it's just totally unfair. Mm -hmm. And back it of you coming from this point of view, it seems a bit very selfish, I might say, but I guess it's politics, so, you know, it's the game. Mm -hmm. But I think it's very unfair. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You're like smiling. Okay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay so, um, it's interesting. I mean, they all had the opportunity to, you know, petition the results, which is what Urbanikoro 
and Wellington did. And then the judgment just came. So of, um, it is said that um, there were no elections held in about 32 polling units. Mm -hmm. You know, so um, with that judgment, now the, 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 the judgment is that um, INEC should withdraw the certificate that has been given and there should be a rerun of an election in, not a rerun, I'm, I'm not sure there will be a rerun in the, in the places they did election. So it will now be the places the election then hold, you know, and then maybe they will now collate you know that result and with the, and then merge and then determine the winner um so my issue is um i'm not really sure that i have any issue re honestly um if i'm not even sure that it is going to tilt towards banky maybe it, because, i mean people are funny the honest truth is they might not even get people to come out and vote that's that's the sad reality because which le which I'm so sorry to yeah. issue, but which leaves them to manipulate manipulate what manipulate. they want to do. Mm, mm. But again, I mean, one can argue that um, that's, are you saying that um, the the um, the the people that's the other two participants, the other two contestants who have who were aggrieved based on that result, they didn't have um, they don't have. They they all have the so, opportunity to go to the court so to let, contest. Let's um, let's let me draw a bit from what you said mm -hmm. because I think Mary is a bit emotional with this. Mm -hmm. Yesterday, Kuleo <laughs> Lawa taught us not to be emotional. He taught us not to be emotional. And the <laughs> funny thing is that he specifically mentioned this particular yeah, guy. He yeah. said that how many bills has the person passed? Mm. You know, but let me keep that one aside because I want to bring that argument later because mm -hmm. that's what we're asking. That is it a good thing mm. for the for Etiosa. Mm. Etiosa is one of the biggest. It's the richest. Don't the, the wealthiest. Richest. Yes. Yes. In the whole of yeah. Nigeria. Not yeah. even like, not yeah. Lagos. Yeah. In the whole of Nigeria. It's yeah. the richest, it's the wealthiest, it's, the, it's everything. Mm. Etiosa is like, hey, <laughs> okay. So, now, the 32 state um, uh, polling units that didn't have, the, they did not conduct an election, are the numbers enough to tilt the results. the results you know that's a question i'd like to ask um INEC. are the numbers enough to tilt the result given that like you rightly pointed out there is going to be a lot of voter apathy mm. not because of anything but just because this recent tribunal result it seemed mm. like everybody that came out to vote it, it's like it's just it was not a waste of time. it was a waste of time mm. so a lot of there's a lot of voter apathy right now people mm. are not even interested in going out to any polling unit mm. but it can go two ways True. it can go that you know what i will show you people that we won this election yeah. and we will come people out come again back and vote yes. it can go that way or it can go the other way to say you know what Whatever you want to do at this point, do. do. I do not care. Exactly. So it's two ways. We really don't know. I, I sadly, I, I, I might live in Etiosa, but I, I didn't change my polling unit. I, I still vote in a Koshafe local government area. So sorry for you people. <laughs> <laughs> you know, but I, I'm not. I'm not about to come out to vote. Mm. Why? Because. First of all, I'm not sure of my safety. I know what happened in the governorship elections. After what had happened in the presidential election, and they saw that, um, you know, they were like um, pockets of most polling units in Magodo, for instance, that I voted, the um, Labour Party won. So most of the thugs came out for governorship elections. So you can now imagine what will happen now. Mm. You understand? There will be a lot of, I don't, I cannot guarantee that there will not be um, violence. You understand? Mm. Because now it is a case of who can can mobilize more yes. to be able to get yeah. that vote. Mm. So, but the question for today is that, is the dismissal of a task win? Mm. Is it a good thing for Etiosa? And I told my guys at the back end, um, Joy and Omolala, to please pull out um, details yeah. for me. Yeah. Not even really so much of statistics, more of um, track record. Mm. Who's this guy? Do you understand? We've, we've had yeah. Obanikoro yeah. on this chair. Mm. You understand? Yeah, they say they're not supposed to do some things, but you're supposed to propose bills. You're supposed to do a lot of things. Um, Etiosa local government constituency is not a joke. It's not. Literally, right? And again, the, we have so many problems. At this point, I do not care who is elected. The only thing I will care is the person's competence. Mm -hmm. I don't care what party you belong to. 
Because a chosen is not a joke. I know the suffer that I'm suffering. You understand? On this Lekki Express Expressway, for instance, just, just give that one as an instance. Mm. Do you understand? It is not a joke. So anybody that is coming to represent us in Etiosa must know what they're doing. Mm. You must really, really understand the pain that people are going through. We don't have an alternative road. True. So if there is a lockdown on this Lekki Express Express, we are all stuck. So look at when the, um, what's it called, those NSARS things happened. Do you understand? When the NSARS, when the lockdown, all of those things happened. It was a day I was still on that road till 5 a.m. It wasn't a joke. Because, you know, like, if you're going to the mainland, there are yeah. other routes you can take to your destination. Mm. On this Lake Express Express, it's just one road. Most of all the, what's it called, the alternate roads that they are constructing, they're still under construction. They've not finished it. So for me, it's not about whether uh, it is a Labour Party or is a, I'm not emotional. What I want is who will represent my interest that understands the pain that I'm going through. And I will say, you know what, I want to propose bills and I want to fight for my constituency so that we can get better living. We're generating a lot of revenue for these guys. Too much. Too much actually. But you know what, let's take a break because I want to read out what they found and... We will now continue from there, but let's go on a very short break. We'll be right back. All right, thanks for staying with us. Now, if you just tuned in, it's our ladies' night out. Diola, Mary, and I are having a conversation around this tribunal, the recent judgment that just came out again for Etiosa uh, constituency. And we're asking, is the dismissal of Ataz Wayne, is he... A good thing for Etiosa local government. That's the question. A number to call is 70 2500 That's the number to call. Remember, turn off the volume of your television, whatever it is that you're watching us from, so we don't get the feedback. Um, I would really love to hear what Etiosa people living in Etiosa constituency have to say about this. Um, remember, you can also send us an SMS or WhatsApp to zero eight one eight zero three eight four six six three. All right. So I mean. Uh, so I said, I said to my team, I said, please guys, can you help me find out what the track record is and all of that? Okay. So Joy came back to me. She says, number one, Atta has no achievements since he won. I remember that's what Kule Lawal said. Won. Since he won, there's really nothing visible he's proposed in the house. Nothing. Right? There's nothing he's done in the house. Number two, Banky W had a successful musical career. But left to join politics in 2022, the musician who spoke when he appeared as a guest on a TV channel um, explained that the, the decision to join politics was driven by his desire for good governance in the country. Banky W founded I Am Capable Scholarship Fund, a platform he uses to give back to the society. The foundation provides tuition to assist youth. Atat Tadios, on the other hand, a chief... He says he's a Nigerian politician, businessman. He won the National Assembly elections on Friday, 25th, uh, 25th to clinch the House of Representatives. Nothing on him that he's done, like he's like tangible that we can see. Obani Kora, on the other hand, as a member of the House of Representatives, he launched an, empower, uh, an empowerment program that provided financial grants to petty traders, motorbikes, uh, mo motorbikes to residents' association, security operatives to aid, to aid their community security efforts, he facilitated many legislative programs that was sponsored by Small Medium Scale Enterprise Agency of Nigeria to combat poverty and promote human capital development. Atat defeated, of course, both of them. Um, and um, since the polls, he's really not done anything in the house. So for me, track record matters. Then even if it's not track record, we're in the era of social media. If I type your name on Google, what are the things that I'm supposed to be seeing about mm. you? Mm. You understand? Because it's not enough for you to say, first of all, you're popular. I won. Yeah. Or you won. You know, because all of them, look at... So how did he win you know, Labour Party? He, he, so that's the thing, right? He, I could, I could swear that if I had a ticket... You would have won. Do you understand? Like, if I was a candidate under the Labour Party because of the wave of the moment. Yeah. Right. And this is where I want to like give a, a, a caution to everybody that won under the Labour Party. You won not because you people really wanted you to, I mean, like people knew you mm. for your competence. No, you won because of the 
the rave of the moment. You won because yeah. there was there was something in the air. You people rode on Peter Obi's uh, whatever, and you won. Now between that time that you've been in the house till now, Oga, what have you proposed? Yeah. So it's not enough for us to be. I don't see. I've told myself with politics now. I am removing anything emotions. I'm not interested. So like I said, I do not care who, what party you come from, what party you belong to. As long as you're delivering, right, is what I want. Mm -hmm. What are you delivering for us? You know, so I don't know. What's your take? Because based on this reading, if you were to even pick a candidate. It would be a bunny for me. Well, based on the reading. Yeah. Based yeah. on the reading. But I can't I can't pick up a Nikoro again too because he's been there. Mm -hmm. Right? And if we are complaining of the problems that we're having, it means that maybe there's something not fundamentally uh, that's not been fundamentally done. You just said track record. Mm -hmm. Which one do you want to <laughs> The person that has the most track record. Is what, what, what did you mention about Banky W? Is he a successful musician? And he has foundation. Mm -hmm. He's a politician now, obviously. Who is not going to open a foundation? Mm -hmm. That's that's the game now. You have to be giving back to the commission, giving back to the committee. Aside from that, what else again has he done? Mm -hmm. I mean, I, I, I like where Mary is going with this. We also mon must not sentimentalize this. The fact that Banke is popular. I mean, we're not trying to say to anybody, this is who you should vote for, but... We, we must come to a realization that we have a choice mm -hmm. and our choices must be based on, on reality. It must, again, I, I, I think one of the things, when people are campaigning, they don't campaign on issues. Mm. That's a problem. Because they, what's the issue? Because, okay. because what's the use of mm. campaigning on the issue? No, what's the, what's the no. Use? See, that that's the when problem. When they say when it's rigged election, no, 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 no. The election is one part. Campaigning on issues signify that you do not only know what the issues are. You have a blueprint of how to manage. If I can win without issues. campaigning about the issues, then mm -hmm. why should I campaign about the issues? No, you don't. Mm. You, it, but you see, that's also the problem. Because that's, no, that's I'm, also I'm just, the problem. Yeah. Because our culture here for campaigns is about manifesto. It's about promises. Promises that they have no idea how to implement. Pro you can't be telling me that you want to, you will build more schools. What schools are you building? Do you even know how many children are in your constituency? Do you know how many classrooms you need to build? Do you know? Do, do, do yeah. you These are basic statistics that should inform whatever solution you think, okay, this constituency is having. Okay, someone says they want to. Again, another thing. These guys, I honestly feel that they do not even understand their responsibilities or what they should be doing as house members. Mm. They think it is their job to fix roads. It's not. It's not. It's not your, it's not your job. job. It's not your, your job. Your job is, is in the place of go, policies exactly. and, and, you go know. Go and represent anything that cons concerns Etiosa. Your job is to say, oh, in Etiosa, yes, this, this is how much we are giving yes, in no. terms of tax in terms of revenue to the state okay this is what we expect we expect that businesses are coming to this area they should have xyz amount of electricity we e bring up negotiation yes. okay so and out, out of those bills candidates now who do you think is going to be there? Who, who 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 can manage this fit at least okay not to be sentimental honestly yeah um I would hold brief for Obanikoro. Okay. And I'll tell you why. Regardless of how we look at it, governance politics is also about negotiation. Mm. Yes. It's about on it's, it's, it's about collaboration. It's about knowing, okay, you know what? Can you stand for my because you see, if you propose a bill, you need to get that bill passed. You yeah. have to lobby. Yes. You must lobby. You yes. must lobby. You must. So it is beyond... You must be a, I mean, exactly. you must be a powerful negotiator. Exactly. You must be a people's person. You must be able to win people and over to your side. you must even understand the politics of the game. Yeah. There's a politics to it. It's not enough for you to have the zeal and passion. Mm -mm. There's a politics to it. 
So who speaks the politics? Who speaks the language of politics? So, so I was coming to that because mm -hmm. you see the the challenge I am having. You know, before I used to be, you know, but now I think it, it's my clear. head. Gets, <laughs> my head is getting clearer when it comes to all this political matter. You know, mm -hmm. the truth is right. It is one thing for us to understand that yes, these are the problems. Mm -hmm. But it's another thing for us to be able to understand how to go about solving those problems. Yeah. So I remember when the young man that was contesting against Desmond in Emily Lib in the Surrey Liberal yeah. Labour Party came to the, the studio. I remember getting a call from somebody very powerful in Lagos State and saying that, well, <laughs> who is this person that says he wants to go to the House of... Does the person even understand the amount of, what's it called, negotiations and politics and whatever that you need to play, mm -hmm. even within the House? So it's not enough. See, Nigerians problem is a lot of problems mm. right so for you to be able to even survive and stand or withstand whatever you need to be able to speak i've said this thing that you cannot come out they can't see you coming if politicians see you coming they put up a defense yeah do you understand they cannot see you coming so i'm not particularly going to hold before bani Kuru because i feel like he you know hasn't really really delivered mm. on etiosa etiosa has a potential was was he in Etiosa? Yes, no. Mm -hmm. Etiosa has the potential. He was coming back for a, a second. A sec time. Yeah. Oh. So Etiosa has a huge potential that I feel that even him doesn't really understand the intricacies of Etiosa. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? So I mean, like literally, it is one thing for us to say that um, uh, what's it called? It's one thing for us to say that there is a problem. It's another thing for you to be able to solve that problem mm -hmm. and understand the dynamics. Or solving that problem mm. so if i am if i'm to answer the question if um Atas win the dismissal of his win if, if it's a good thing for us i'll say yes i'll say yes because i want them all of them again to come back with a manifesto mm. do you understand literally not with a manifesto or whatever with with, with with a blueprint, a blueprint. and give an us a yes, an actionable blueprint exactly. Give us like maybe seven proposals that you want to go and propose in the house when you're going there. Exactly. So you're not just going there and going there to sit quietly, mm. right? You are you are coming prepared to say, okay, you understand the the intricate um, um, what's it called challenges that um, Etiosa has, and you are ready to. These are your seven point or eight point or hundred point um, proposals that you want to propose to the house because. Like literally, since when were, were, um, have they resumed office since till now? Yeah. If it's somebody that's craving for, you should have at least, at least shout and say, oh, you're trying to propose a bill or they did not, <laughs> they, nobody gave you audience. So. But you've really not done anything. So I think that it's a good thing. I don't it's know. Just been how many years? Eh? You said what? It's just been how many years? Ah. 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 But there are real issues. That ah. like, the, the revenue is not stopping. That's the thing. It just keeps giving revenue. I mean, you, you, you have a, lo a whole lot of taxes coming from this thing. He's collecting money now. Is he not collecting money? He's collecting salary. So he must justify his salary and his allowances. So who you have not answered the question? What's it? Who, who is holding brick? Who are you holding brick? I've told you, said none of them. <laughs> she wants the three of them to come back. Let them come back and tell me what it is that they want to. Because I know that the challenges in the church are yeah. there are a lot. Literally, we are we are actually Good suffering. Network. Oh, it's terrible. It's so much. It's Water. terrible. Have you seen the? I, like I've I've Security. lost two tires. Yeah. You know, on that road, if you see the big massive craters on the road, you're just driving. Boom! You just go into. So Obani Koro keeps patching. Since Obani Koro <laughs> has not been there, I've not. They patched it a bit, but they don't patch again. You know, like it's terrible. Patching. We are we are we are we are bigger than that. You know, so I, I feel like you know it's a good thing. Mm. Let everybody go back to their drawing board and come mm. and find a real, like, real blueprint for us to say, okay, this is how they want I to see it inside the next four years. The and they then bring back the blueprint and let us watch it again. You know, mm. then we were concentrating so much on the presidential. presidential. We didn't yeah. really pay attention to their blueprint. Mm. So let them bring the blueprint. It's true. I'm, I'm being honest. Absolutely. Uh, did you pay attention to the blueprint? You said there was a blueprint. Okay. Do you know where the blueprint is? Okay. Producer, please, can you send the blueprint? <laughs> <laughs> there is one. <laughs> it a blueprint. Please send it. But hey, I think yeah. it's a good thing. But let me hear your thoughts on um, general um, the 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 tribunal because again, Mary touched on it a bit. Mm. Should we approach this to say that it's a witch hunt? 
well it won't be absolutely incorrect <laughs> but i won't also categorically say correct that you don't be on the fence no no but really <laughs> Ati, i don't you know have that. <laughs> I mean, that's the best i can do like you know, that's the best like i can this, do like you see when they say when the elephant fights the grass suffers right mm. there is always cause and there's always cause and effect mm. you so you can't um it's a game they all understand. Mm. Yeah. It, they all understand yeah. it. So I think it is us looking from the outside <laughs> <laughs> that it feels. But they understand it. And they know that the minute anything is challenged, they, are, they know. Do, do you understand? So whether it is a witch hunt, because you see, the, the, the thing can be flipped. We, we don't have politicians in Nigeria who believe in the ideology of whatever party they are in. They are only in parties that can give them the best opportunity to be in whatever seat they can. So you can't really say that, oh, okay. Because you see, if they give one of them a chance to go to another party and say, don't worry, just keep quiet. Next um, election cycle, that place that you are going, you will clinch. You will say, okay, let me keep quiet. There's no need for me to even... Ch mm -hmm. That's the way politics work in Nigeria. So really, you... It, are they being with mm, well it's very but you can't put anything past nigeria that's what i have seen you can't mary it's like you have a direct answer <laughs> Ma 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 is yes 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 that's my answer mm. yes it is i mean it's sad but me too i'm also understanding the politics so yeah but is it really really a witch hunt yeah is it really really mm. If if elections did not hold in thirty two polling polling units, I mean it's a huge number. It's not something to to just gloss over. Mm. Except if the yeah, but it was submission it is was not challenged. correct, and that's why they went to court, right? Mm. Court <laughs> justice. They went to tribunal. Let me put it like that. Mm. Mm. That's why they went to tribunal. <laughs> But because, of course, the presidential, there was a whole lot of attention on that, we didn't really focus on the other hmm. little okay, the petitions. that we focused on now. Eh, but, I mean, Pule, okay, I wish you were here yesterday, because Pule was here yesterday, and he gave us a different perspective on the, on the judgment of the tribunal, really. And for me, you know, when I go home, I kept thinking about it. And what Pule said, really, it did make sense. You can't come to a tribunal and expect me to fight your battles. I won't do it. You have to come ready for war. Hmm. But you didn't come prepared. You came for a battle. Mm -hmm. Meanwhile, it was a war. You, you know what I just figured out? Yeah. Eh? It, it seems like... It seems like... I'm like a Peter of bitches. We're still falling on emotions. Mm -hmm. When it's a bitch realize that, look... It's a game. And we're all here to fight. Mm. Nobody cares about Simple. that you are crying. Oh, yeah, that's that's the thing. Oh, yeah. Simple. So and guess what will happen <laughs> in Nigeria? There are no rules. Mm. They play very dirty. dirty. And that's why they say that a yeah. lot of times that women don't even dare to go into politics yeah. and all of that. Because the game is very messy. Is. Very Nobody messy. is gonna spare you to say, Oh, because she's a woman, let's treat her something. No. Yeah. Yeah. Do you understand what I'm saying? So that's why I'm saying that for me. For, well, for Etios, I'm, ha I'm happy. Oh. Let all of them go back to the drawing board. Because again, there are people that are shouting and saying, who is that Ata guy? Mm. Banky W that should have won, you know, because they, they felt it was it's popularity popular. and yeah, all of that. Yeah. But you see, this one now, the Ata, if it truly has substance, mm. now is the time to go and bring out all your arsenals. Mm -hmm. Because it is no longer about a Peter Obi. There's yes. nobody you're yeah. riding on. Yeah. Yeah. You yeah. really must bring out substance. People yeah. must know you. How yeah. can I go on Google? To check who you are, what you've done. I can't find anything exactly. about you. You know, even my small self as I did, like if you Google my name, you'll see some things. <laughs> you know, no, you Google yourself. Yeah. Seriously. Let me take one caller. Hey, finally, Oniru, Etiosa, Shedrak. <laughs> I told them only yeah, Etiosa. Good, good evening. What do you think? Or do you like the tribunal's judgments? Yeah, quickly. I want to delete the minute. He said something about the election, the wrong election, the next day. 
Hello, can you hear me? Ah, we can hear you. Go ahead. There, there must be a reason for the election before they cancel the election. Mm -hmm. They don't don't cancel election because of one party or one. Guy. There must be a reason for it. So, if they found a fault somewhere, or there is a foul play somewhere, is the it is the duty of the tribunal to cancel the election and for them to do the way wrong. So whether it's because the you know, Labour Party only have few spots in 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 the in this past election doesn't mean that they can get away with anything. So if there is foul play, then something must be done about it. Don't okay, like Chandra, do you do you like do you like the party. idea that they cancelled it? Yes, there is a reason for that in the first place. I know there's a reason, but are you happy about it? That's what I'm saying. So that we will have a rerun. Is that what you're... I'm just asking. Well, if the reason is genuine, then it is fine by me. Okay. But if it, if it is because the Jagaban is there, he's trying to sweep him back all his lost position, then that's not fine. Okay, okay. But if there is a foul play somewhere, Yes, it is fine. Okay. But if you are trying to use veto, that is totally out of it. All right. Thank you so much, Edward. So that's what I'm trying to say. But because the way she was talking, I think she is somehow biased. She is not happy that you are taking it from LP. Mm. It is not about LP. It is about the credibility of the election. Of the elections. Mm -hmm. Alright, thank so you so thank much. thank you and have a nice <laughs> evening. Thank you, Shedra. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so don't, they say don't be emotional. Okay. Follow the facts and the figures. Mm -hmm. let, let them tell us the facts and the figures now. <laughs> let them tell us. Right. Uh -huh. Let them tell us. Mm -hmm. And let them actually tell us. Mm -hmm. It's one thing, it's one thing, I mean, there's no reason and then you just come up and then you say, tell us. Let's be open if we want to really be free and fair. Mm. Be open about it. Okay, so, but um, Atai is not contesting the fact that there was no election in 32 polls. Mm. He, he, he He's not contesting it. So, mm. he means if he actually he knows. knows. That's what I'm saying. See, let me tell you okay. something. Me, I'm happy. Mm. Atao, Banki W, Vanikoro, you people should go and brace yourself. Because mm. now, you will need to bring your blueprint manifesto mm. because it's not about yeah there's no distraction now yeah Etiosa people will come out i believe they will come out to vote but they really now must see your manifesto mm. in its true self and if Atta, if Atta knows what he's doing i mean he already he has will win it again. Day. exactly he, he has 26 000 has... already they're not doing for the other places so yeah. it's just the places that they yeah. know yeah. And so that he that do his own work. already is in the system. Yeah. So he, he, I mean, except he, he doesn't know work. what he is doing. Maybe. He should go and do his homework. Mm -hmm. But me, I don't like idea of which one shall in case. So just in case, Tribuna, we are watching you before. Mm -hmm. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> thank you, Diola. Thank you, Mary. <laughs> Mary, are you going to vote? If you like, be watching them. <laughs> Whether you watch or you don't watch. They will whatever, do what they want to Whatever do. will be, will be. Follow us across <laughs> our social media handles at Wish Africa. You can interact with us further, drop a comment, and more importantly, follow all our engagements on social media. Like, share, and invite your families and friends to watch and follow the conversation. If you missed our quote for today, here it is again. The February 25th election has just been rightly declared inconclusive and supplementary elections have been ordered by the court. INEC has been ordered to withdraw the return certificate and conduct elections in areas where it didn't hold on election day. So this is from Banikoro Ibrahim. So we will see you guys tomorrow at 8 p.m. as we bring another great conversation to your screen. Ciao.